So I got there about five minutes early and they of course park you at the perfect table to just be the person who keeps looking over your shoulder being like, is she coming? Is she gonna be here? Is she late? I was really nervous. <laughs> I guess, you know, it's, it's not that often that a first date is dinner and um, especially someone who's gonna rate you on how you do and have to recount everything. I see her walk up with uh, the hostess and I was just like, okay, great. Once I saw him and you know, we hugged hello and it got a lot more easy and natural. So I like, jumped out of my seat um, to say hi. So I was pretty impressed right away. It was interesting because I'm not quite sure I would have chosen the Brixton for a first date, but, um, but it worked out really well. Being how surprised we were that the place actually had food, we were like looking at the menu and we said, we had a, we had a plan with this. I got the fish and chips because what else am I gonna order at a British restaurant, a British pub? Um, and he got rabbit. Like you could tell right away if the girl was gonna be judging you, she'd be like, oh my God, he's eating a dead bunny, but she didn't give me a hard time for that. I don't know, I didn't try it. I didn't have the guts, but uh, he, said it was, he said it was good. I was pretty surprised that she was probably the biggest Nationals fan that I had ever seen. And we talked a lot about baseball. Um, because that is really all that's on my mind these days with our poor postseason. I kept seeing her like looking over my shoulder at the TV because the O's game was about to start. So we were like, we're gonna probably want to go somewhere else if we're gonna watch the game. She was like, I think we should just go to the pug. We kissed goodnight. Um, he asked for my number and I had forgotten that he didn't have it just because we'd been hanging out for so long and it, um, it just felt so natural that it's like, oh wait, this was our first date and we haven't spoken on the phone before. Like I think the date lab is a great way to get people in the chair and then we just kind of got up out of the chair and like went out on Friday night. I mean, I'm looking forward to seeing him again. So, uh, so yeah, I was, yeah. <laughs>